Like the video in the next five seconds or your jump shot's gonna go broken. You'll never green again. I would not risk it. All right, what is good, YouTube? It's your boy, Summer Matt, back with another video. So, in today's video, I'm gonna teach you guys how to shoot with the low three point shot in NBA 2K20. As y'all can see, I'm on my 98 overall, Paint B Center has a 51 three pointer. And in my opinion, if you have below a 60 three point shot, you should not shoot as consistently as I was in the gameplay you're about to see. Now, I'm a legend. So, instead of seven shooting badges with this build, I get 17. All right, so with this build, I should I normally would have 27, 1, 24. All right, so I get plus 10 to all of these. So I have more badges than I should, but that still doesn't mean I should be able to shoot as consistently with a 51 three point shot, man. But if you guys want to know the full build for my shooting paint beast, let me know. I'll drop a video on him. And for the jump shot, I would use in base 38. Now, the thing is, with a low three point shot like that, like when you have a 60 or low three pointer, you're really limited to only two bases, which is like 38, 98, X um. Well, I heard 98 is broken, which is why I said two bases. So basically, 38 and X um for low three point shots, right? With that being said, I'm gonna get right into the gameplay and I'm gonna show you guys how to shoot with a non shooting build. So let's get right into it. I know that you fall in love with me and it's hard, dog. Be fighting my love and protecting your heart like a guard dog But you know that it's okay I got your heart, I won't break I got some more money, I went to the bank Be trying right away, be can't swim, so you say You say you got choppers, you shoot in the Alright, so y'all want to know how to shoot with a low 3 point rating So, let me tell y'all this real quick My teammate has Hall of Fame shooting And Hall of Fame finishing right now So I don't even have Hall of Fame floor general on But you see me cash in with my pain beast Now one thing I can definitely tell y'all Listen, I already know what y'all gonna say. Y'all gonna say you only shooting greens because you are a legend. I'm gonna be honest. Even if you have fit, let's even if I have 50 shooting batters, right? With the 51 three pointer, I should not be shooting how I was. Now, I'm not saying I'm shooting top of the key limitless range because that's not what I'm doing. But listen, I could tell y'all this, bro. When I get all 17 of my shooting badges with this build, I'm gonna be shooting from top of the key. I can just let y'all know. I can let y'all know this now. Now the reason why I'm only shooting from the right corner is because I got a hot spot there, and it's actually hard to get hot spots on the build with a low three point. You see me shooting a white. I missed that shot. It's actually super hard to get hot spots on the build with a low low three pointer because you're not even gonna be making your shots to get the hot spots. Me, I was actually greening most of my shots with this build, right? <clears throat> like I was greening like. Out of like 10 shots, I was granted like four or five shots. And when you get takeover with your paint beast, it's actually a glitch. It don't matter what takeover you have, you're going to shoot endless amount of greens to take over. So I made it important that when I get my takeover or when I'm close to my takeover, I have to shoot a green because when I get takeover, I'm not gonna miss. Now, obviously, if you're a legend, that helps because I get more shooter batters than normal. But it's not like in this gameplay I actually had all my shooting badges. I only had 11 out of the 7 that I normally have. Even when white, listen, if you're in takeover, you even make your whites, bro. I'm telling you, like, let's, because on a paint beast, you could choose rim takeover and I think slasher. Pretty sure it's slasher because this build also gets contact dunks, like driving contact dunks. Like I said, if you guys wanna want me to make a video on this build, smash that like button. I could show you exactly how I made my build. Bro, just know when I get all my shooting badges on this build, I'm, it's gonna be nasty, man. It's gonna be nasty. Like, I'm talking about a center that can drive and get contact dunks every single play because it has a 90, like a 91 driver dunk, I think, at 99. It can get contact dunks repeatedly and it can spot up and shoot greens in the corner. Like, what other build can do that? Now, with an interior finisher. A terrier finisher get a slightly higher three than a pain beast. I think it gets like a 54 or 55. But it don't get Hall of Fame defensive badges. That's the thing. Like with this build, I get 34 defensive badges and I'm going to have 30 finishing with 17 shooting. And a terrier finisher, yeah, you get a higher three pointer. But yeah, you get a high three pointer and 20 shooting. But you're only going to get gold finish, uh, gold uh, defensive. I want Hall of Fame defensive and Hall of Fame finishing to make the build way better. And look at me though. Look how consistently I'm shooting. And I'm not even cutting anything. I'm letting everything play out so y'all can see like I'm not. Like I'm, I'm literally like not cutting anything so y'all can see how good the shooting is with this build. Now, a lot of people when they make the shooting paint beast, they go 6'10". 
I made mine 6'9". The reason why I made my build 6'9", I made them 6'9 for one reason. Well, more than one reason. But the main reason why I made them 6'9", is because once you go 6'9", that is the last height you can shoot quickly off of. So once you go 6'10", your quick draw is super slow, right? Like, you're going to have that center speed when you shoot. So why would I go 6'10", if I, if I don't want to shoot like a center? I want to shoot like... I just want to shoot quicker that's why i went 69 also you get a higher vertical higher speed it, and you get a higher driving dunk so it's way better to make this paint beast at 69 i know a lot of people make videos on this on their paint beast build they go 610 i'm telling you guys 69 is way better it's more athletic it's just better in overall in general so if you guys make the shooting paint beast i strongly advise you all to go 90 or i said 90 go 69 also when shooting with this build and you're not a legend, I'm not even going to lie to y'all, it's going to be real hard for y'all to get y'all shooting badges. I didn't even get my shooting badges. I didn't even start off with shooting badges. I had to hit legend, then I made the build. You know what I mean? Like, that's that's how hard it is. Like, getting shooting badges on a non-shooting build with the low three-pointer is going to take you a while because one, you're not going to be able to hit your shots. Two, when you do hit your shots, you don't even get a lot towards them. It's just going to take mad time to get all your badges. That's why I had to wait for me to hit legend to make a video on how to shoot a non-shooting build. I do I do plan on making a lot of builds. Like I do plan on making the all reds like a pure, like a 6-5 pure lockdown. If you guys want to see that, let me know. Or any other build you want to see. You see me cashing out. Like I'm telling you, in this game, you can shoot with any three-point shot in this game, bro. Any three-point shot. You don't need a high three-pointer to shoot in this game. The only reason why I made... A shooting lockdown is because I don't want to just shoot from the corner. I want to shoot from limitless range. Obviously, I can make a pair of lockdown and shoot in the corner. I mean, but that's not what I wanted to do. I made my rerun and win because I want to shoot from deep and still have, you know, a little bit of like a good, kind of like a good defense. You know what I mean? So, you see me making that white. Now, once I get all my shooting badges, I'm literally going to drop a video of me shooting from limitless range on my pink piece, man. That video is going to be dope. You guys are going to see me top of the key, limitless range shooting greens with a 6'9 pink beats with a 51 three-point shot now at 99 i get a 52 three-point shot and at 99.9 .9, i'm gonna get a 53 but i'm probably not gonna be at 99.9 .9. i'm probably just gonna be at 99 overall so i'm basically gonna have a 52 three most of the time with the 91 driving dunk i'm gonna be able to get contact dunks and shoot threes now the mid range the mid range is too, pretty much automatic that's why i don't show y'all gameplay me shooting mid ranges because the mid range is like a 66 I'm gonna be able to hit that consistently. I don't like shooting mid range is not even fun to me. I like shooting threes. That's why I show gameplay at mainly me just shooting threes. But the 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 main way to shoot consistently with a low three pointer man, you need Hall of Fame floor general, Hall of Fame dimer, shooting boost, Gatorade. You need everything. Like when you have a low three pointer, you have to throw every weapon you can to help you shoot. I'm talking about jump shot boost, Gatorade, dimer, Hall of Fame floor general, Hall of Fame like catch and shoot corner specials like every badge that you have you have to throw that in effect because you have a 52 you're gonna have a 52 three you need everything you can now my teammate only has it on gold but gold still worked out for me i already knew i was going to be able to hit because i am a legend I, I have enough badges for me to shoot consistently you know what i mean i already knew i was going to be able to shoot greens that wasn't the issue i already knew i was going to be able to shoot so when people play against me and they see that I'm a paint beast in the corner, they literally sag off of me because they don't expect me to shoot. That's why I also made the paint beast because when I'm when I'm playing twos and I sit in the corner, they they're gonna be like, oh, he's a paint beast, leave him open. But when they see me greening, they're not gonna know what to do. And if they play up, I can just run past them and get a contact. Like look at this. I'm the best shooting paint beast in the game. You see, look, I'm not even I'm not even hiding anything. I went three for four. I missed one three pointer with the fifty one shot three look another guy who's leaving me open he doesn't expect me to green and honestly i do recommend you guys sticking with 38 when shooting with a low three pointer like that's that's the best jump shot in the game it's the most universal jump shot i strongly advise y'all to use jump shot 38 this is the only jump shot that you're going to be able to hit consistently with a 52 three pointer like i'm shooting super consistent with a 52 three pointer but if i made it this far comment go to paint beast let me see who really support me who really you know watch my videos who really you know support the grind let me know if you guys wanted me to make any other builds and play on them i will get this build to 99 to drop more gameplay when i get all my shooting badges thank y'all for watching man it's been your boy stumpy
Hit that bell if y'all new. Smash the like button on the video. Smash, try to smash 1K likes. And I'll catch y'all in the next video, y'all. I'm out. Peace.